All right, <clears throat> I'm going to read this, this one, but I'm going to show it because it's a nice matate. Um, and what I want to show is that, of course, it was is formed as volcanic rock, and it was it was formed by pecking and grinding. But but um, I just want to show you the the. It seems to be hard to find to show it on a picture. Just the use and how this has been used, and how again typical of these um, flat uh, surfaced monos, or I mean uh, matates. <clears throat> they kind of are thick at one end and they kind of taper down to being a little thinner on the other end. Um, on this one in particular, it looks like they, they did do some pecking in order to rough up the surface at one time because it's indented. You can see it's indented there from use and it, it could be just because it was just used so much but most of the time if they're indented they've they've pecked it to rough up the surface and they keep doing that and that's what forms the bowl it's raining on it anyway I just wanted to show in the back side of it but this is a really really nice uh, matate and and the mono is right here which is uh, is a, it's a what, the, what this one shows is that, <clears throat> as you can see, it, um, it's, it's a classic pedestal type mono, but it, it's flat on one side, so it actually, where you can see they've used it a lot, this flat part right here, right in here, which then, of course, then they used it and they grabbed it like this. You can tell. I mean, it fits. You, it just fits perfectly. And then, the, and then, and then, this is how they would grind. But see if I can show that um, surface here, how it's it's been used and and uh, flattened out there. It's pretty. It's a pretty nice set here. And let's see if I can even get a shot of the. It's so hard to show you how that that has curved down and uh, anyway it's a it's a really nice set I'm gonna relist it